Hey, my name is Jasmine and welcome to the Revolution of Consciousness channel. So, coming to you again today from these beautiful beaches in Mazente and you know, I've spent so much of the past couple of weeks just being in the moment, letting go of thoughts and just existing in the now truly breathing it in and taking it in you know the the future doesn't exist it only exists in my mind and the past doesn't exist it only exists in my memories all i have is this moment right now and when i'm surrounded by so much beauty why would i want to spend it in my head missing all the little details of it i want to be in the moment i want to soak it up fully and I mean, there is a multitude of reasons why the moment is such a good place to dwell, but that's just one of them really. So what is the moment? The moment is happening right now. It's the only thing that really truly exists. We have two points of awareness, two states of consciousness really, like we can exist within the thought stream lost within the thoughts in the head or we can exist as the witness and when we are in the moment we're more the witness we're in that other state of consciousness so why is the moment so important <laughs> the moment is so important because we miss so much when we are not in the moment if i was sat here right now thinking and contemplating and thinking about what I'm going to do next, what I'm going to do in the future, what so-and-so said, blah, 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 then I miss the breeze in my hair, the blissful feeling of the breeze as it passes by. <laughs> and. I miss the feel of the warm sand between my toes. I miss the sound of the fizz of the sea as it kind of bubbles on the sand. <laughs> I miss all of these little intricacies that make me realize that it's just the simple pleasures in life that can bring me so much peace and happiness. I don't need all of this stimulation the TVs, the gadgets, the substances, all of that just gives me this crazy overstimulation <laughs> in life that I'm constantly trying to chase that I can never quite catch. Whereas the moment, it's simplicity. It's what's in my surroundings at this moment that brings me that peace. The moment opens us up to these simple pleasures and when we decide to live more in the moment, we also train ourselves to live more in the moment. We train ourselves to live more from this point of awareness, from witness consciousness, which in itself is so freeing and it's so much more of a happy, peaceful place to live in rather than being constantly tormented by <laughs> the thoughts that go round and round, overthinking. And I mean, so many thoughts, we've just already thought them so many times, we're just repeating thoughts. Thoughts in and of themselves are just stimulation, really. <laughs> so how to come into the moment? Well, we can relieve ourselves from thinking at any moment by simply dropping our thoughts, waking up, dropping our thoughts and coming into the moment, tuning into our senses, seeing what is around us and moving into this other point of awareness. We can do that at any moment. But if we want to come into the moment with intention and really make kind of a, a little bit of a ceremony of it as such, then <clears throat> all we want to do is just close our eyes take a big breath <sighs> drop 
drop thoughts. All of that is irrelevant. Tune into the senses. What can you feel? What can you hear? Just sink into it. If thoughts arise, which they might do, then just let them go. Just let them go once you realize that you're caught in a thought stream. What's the furthest thing you can hear? How does the ground feel beneath you? All of these things bring us into the moment. And we're not thinking about them, that we're just observing them. We're just being and experiencing without the thought, without the contemplation, without the questioning. And just by doing this simple practice, we can really find the answers to many of our questions anyway that we're looking for through thinking. Because it's in this space of stillness that we're really able to find clarity <laughs> a lot of the time, as well as many, many other things. So thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I will link my blog below if you're interested in reading any blog posts on the website. And please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Okay. Bye-bye.